there. So um, if, if you were leading the, leading the way now, as everybody makes their way through the streets of downtown. And the crowd appears, I, I'm no crowd control expert by any means, but it appears to still be plus or minus that, that same yeah, group yeah, that we saw earlier. Yeah. Not a lot of, not a lot of uh, the protesters have, have, uh, have gone home, if you will. Maybe. It seems to be pretty much the same people. Maybe thinned out a, a bit. A bit, but not, a by, bit. not by too much um, at all. Not by too much at all. And whereas earlier, uh, the city of Miami police officers were sort of guiding the group, uh, now it appears that the city of Miami officers that were clearing the road and guiding the group may have stepped away uh, from that role now, as now these bikes, these motorcyclists, have sort of taken the, the, the lead at the right. front of the protest so. here to sort of have the, the people on foot follow them. It's sort of hard to, to figure out what everyone's thinking, really. And, and now the, 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 the chopper photographer did, did us a little favor there by uh, zooming in. So that was over by the Arched Center, the Adrian Arch Center, uh, and looks as though... Uh, you can see the bikers who are leading the way are making their way. I, I'm turned around, but uh, yeah, it's 14th Street and uh, first, it first Ave or Second Ave. Yeah, yeah. As we come along, uh, and let's face it, it's going to be hard for people on foot to keep up with those motorcyclists. Right. Impossible. The the, the city of Miami uh, officers that were leading the protesters earlier were on bicycles, so they could you know keep keep a, a little bit of distance between them and the marchers, but a bike is not a, a motorcycle. So now we're, we're heading south on Biscayne, um, at least the bikers were, but as you mentioned, the, the, the folks on foot are, are kind of far behind, and they're coming up, uh, not Biscayne, but, uh, and, it, and, and those are areas that at least hadn't been closed to vehicular traffic. So now you get into the tricky situation, you get people who are driving from A to B going wherever they're going, and you have protesters on foot or on bikes, and that's where it can get a little little tricky because uh, it's, it's, it's all open. And everyone's safety is of concern. Right, right. The marchers, the people driving in their cars trying to get from point A to point B, the motorcyclists that perhaps you know could hurt themselves or someone on foot with uh, uh, one of the motorcycles. But now is when, uh, yeah, things, things get a little bit uh, tricky for these protesters. And again, they appear to be a little more disorganized. They're just sort of meandering the yeah. streets at this point, the, like... The folks on bikes went one way, and mm -hmm. these, these folks on foot went another.